It is time. It's over the Lightroom. Good time, Brad. It's right about 4 with Lonnie Sam. Let's talk seven over. Just to go down to the course, I've been set for the million. Play to Sam. And then the lightning round is over. Are you ready? Ski dance over the light round. Clears up. Let's start with Brandon in New Jersey. Brandon. Uh, hey, Jim. Brandon. How Jimmy Chill, you got him. What's going on? Uh, so I was, um, I saw some insider buying on uh, Croc stock, and I was wondering what you thought about it. I like Crocs, but I worry about the fat aspect and one day coming in, seeing it down too low, so I'm going to take a pass on it. Let's go to Dave in Illinois. Dave. Dr. Kramer, my mad Philly friend, can we you? settle the sandwich debate once and for all? Pats, Geno's, or Tony Luke? No, it's Geno's. It's always been Geno's. It's where my dad and I had our birthday's birthday. We always hit it at the inner sanctum. Dave, I'll take you there any day of the week. Well, whiz whip. What's happening? Jim, this $20 billion cloud security company is up 75% off its 2022 low and up some 30% so far this year. Last month, you featured this company with others as a third-tier cloud company. So, Jim, I ask your thoughts on Zscaler. Dave, I'm worried about Microsoft actually going into competition with Zscaler, and they've been partners. So I'm going to have to say we want to avoid that one, Dave. Just the way, same way we have to avoid the Bears, frankly, when it comes to fantasy. Sorry. Let's go to Tony in New York. Tony! Hello, Jim. How are you? Tony, I'm good. How about Listen, you? That's, I'm doing good, Jim. Jim, as you know, ETR Properties, the real estate investment trust that owns experiential properties like movie theaters, water parks, and ski centers, it pays a sweet dividend, uh, about seven and yeah, a half. Yeah, but Tony, I got to tell you, they are they they are un they are not worth our trust because now I'm not saying they're dishonest, but I am saying that they've been too episodic in the way they report their earnings. Honest guys, episodic numbers pass. Steve in California, Steve. Jimbo, greetings from Sacramento, a place that's been in your heart. Tenth and P. I used to live there, but of course in my car, very nice neighborhood. What's up? Hey, I'm thoroughly confused by a stock I'm labeling the dog of the Dow. It's been down 10 days in a row after decent earnings. Couldn't go higher yesterday with the Dow at 400 and can't go higher into its ex-dividend date. What is wrong with Honeywell? Oh, my. I am so angry. Now, this, I do this home, this home stretch thing with Jeff Marks. We do it. It's around a little bit after two. He and I went head to head. I thought it was time to buy. We're going to hold it till we think it goes a little bit lower. But I am furious. I think the company's got to do something. I haven't felt this way a long time about Honeywell. I agree with you. But we will buy a little more lower once we're able to do so. I need to go to Bill in Massachusetts. Bill! Hi, Jim Kramer. This is Bill Drummy uh, in Weymouth, Massachusetts. I'm not giving you a booyah, not a double B booyah, not a triple booyah. I'm giving you a quadruple booyah. Holy cow, quad 50 right in your face. I love it. How can I help? Mr. Jim, I just need to take 30 seconds to thank you, Jeff, Sean. Your staff is incredible. These guys work, these young men work so hard. And for thank an older you. guy like me, I appreciate that. Thank I have you. a question on General Dynamics. Sure. With the uh, conflicts in Russia started the war, China getting aggressive with all its neighbors, stealing our intellectual profit, uh, property, and the, 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 the goings on in the South China Sea. I've been right. doing my homework, like you suggest, and I found John General Dynamics. It's been up 17% a year for the last I think five General years. Dynamics is a buy. And I have to tell you, I think the CEO is terrific. It's, it's the right level, 2.3% dividend. And I got to tell you, a chart that is next to Boston Properties is one of the best in the book. Gen Dyne, as some mistakenly call it, is for me. Can I go? Can I go to Rosanna in California? Rosanna. Hi, Jim. Thank you for taking the call. Of course. Love everything you and Jeff do. I'm a member of the investment oh, Fantastic. How about that, Eli Lilly? How about that, NVIDIA? We get some, right? How can I help? Yes. Um, I'm wondering about a, a medical stock that I just came across. It seems to be doing well. Um, it, it is near its 52-week uh, high. Okay. CBX. Oh, they are such a well-run outfit. I got to tell you, I wish we owned that for the club. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the conclusion of the Lightning Round. The Lightning Round is sponsored by TD Ameritrade. 
Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1-800-743-CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.